People might think that I'm an old fogey for saying that Michael Jackson, as others have pointed out, is the one who is guilty here, but I had an aunt who died of alcoholism, and we certainly can't be blamed for her death because we tried everything. We tried talking to her, we tried to get her to go to AA, we tried everything, and there was nothing that we could do. She chose to be an alcoholic. She died of her alcoholism though there were other causes but most of them were based on the fact that she was an alcoholic for example she had diabetes and part of that was because alcohol has sugar in it and the way she drank alcohol she got so much sugar in her bloodstream that of course she got diabetes and so it's the same thing with Conrad Murray you can't fold him for what Michael Jackson was intent on doing anyway and maybe Michael Jackson would have had it that Conrad Murray lost his license but otherwise Conrad Murray should not be held responsible for what Michael Jackson did to himself.